le ka hare ho bothata bona bo boholo ba covid 19 mo so ntso fitisetsa ditshebeletso se tshame ke ka ho letsa tsin la ka jeno ho le mona Brantford Free State mo le tona la ana hala maranda di hokahanyo ha mmoho le ona mahlala ana le mphato ho ha e nta te take mago e le le tona la tuto mona Free State ba tla sheba ho ditshebeletso tsa maranda tse di fetela se tshame ba tla pota ka mona na ka posong ha mmoho le motseng mona na wa Brantford ha re be ka holo ya mo di phone re bona hona ditshebeletso e hlile di fetela se tshame I want to thank the province, I want to thank the district and the local municipality for welcoming us to this area and of course looking forward to an effective collaboration, effective mm -hmm. collaboration that we do not have to wait for the beneficiaries. If a matter is raised by the councillor, we are able to be available to be called. That's why we first check in that, which means the call centre issue must be addressed urgently for those that will be calling the call centre, but I advise that the local leadership gets them contact numbers of these people that we have. Grandford is, is doing very well. The numbers are high, the registrations are coming in, and, and we are we're taking And we have stock. enough stock. Yes, yes. 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 we have enough numbers of installers. Yes. Yes. Yeah. All right, then we hope it means the time is going to pass here. Yeah. One of the key reasons why we then decided that let's make sure that we are sent to this area is to have proper quality tag of the work that has been done by those that have been procured by our agencies to install the boxes and also the quality of the boxes themselves. As we know that there are standards that have been put there, are they working, do, uh, do people receive signal and everything? Like here saying you've discovered the two households, which is why now we must hold all those that we have paid accountable to say why must they steal the money from the state and deprive our people of access to communication and information. We are going there, I have the full team that is responsible for DTT from the post office, Centec, USASA and their service providers that must make sure that that is addressed with immediate effect. Smart And we said, let's make a donation towards the masks and the sanitizers so that we can continue to follow the protocols, save our people. This is simply to say when we're giving messages on Corona, when we're giving messages on what's happening in the country, you have all the SABC stations, sorry, the SABC stations and other stations, but we're going to be increasing those channels of SABC to 16 channels. We're going to have a health channel, we're going to have an educational channel, a sport channel, and other channels that we're adding there. So that's why we insist that please pay your TV license because we want proper content that must go on those channels so that we can see you here telling people what needs to be done in the, in the health channel that we'd like to establish. My name is Marlon Finnis. I'm Centex Executive of Operations. Uh, Centec is a company that does the radio and TV signal distribution for the country. Um, our role is basically within this current project as what the Minister has been uh, over, uh, doing the oversight visit for, is to do the installations of DTT set-top boxes uh, for the indigenous communities. 
is part of a, of a, of a plan from the, from, from, from the government to ensure that our indigenous households are empowered to receive the digital TV signal. And we will be starting with the rollouts of boxes uh, in the uh, Brantford area uh, very soon um, to ensure that uh, we're able to um, empower more people to be able to take up the DTT signal. Today we are here in Brantford as part of the oversight work that we were doing in order to make sure that the services that we commission as government are rendered successfully but also that the, benef the, 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 the beneficiaries really get what they're supposed to get. Of course we started from the post office and we were happy with what is happening in the post office. There is no challenge there, even in times of uh, in terms of the social grants, the long queues, there's nothing like that. The people are happy. We, of course, have a responsibility to check again in terms of the numbers that register for, for the set-top boxes in the program that we call Digital Migration. Again, we are happy with reaching the targets of the area as the numbers that were given by State SA. And, of course, we wouldn't then leave the area without visiting the households where people have received these set of boxes. In other homes, we were very happy. But of course, there's two incidents where we've seen the soldier work that has been done by the service provider. And I have then mandated the team to make sure that they follow up on that and get to be addressed on time. Le ka ha go coronavirus di tsebeletse tsa bohlokwa di tlamela di le di fetela sechabe ke ka ho le tona le tshaketse mo na Brantford mo le go sheba go na set top box in the tsola sechaba sa mo na molemo ha ho le sechaba sa free start re bona re tshakela di nape di ba kentse fa pane mo a sheba ho go na tsebetso ntse ya jwa lo re na sechaba se khotso fetse ka taba yena ya set top box re bona le yena o buile ntla bohlokwa go batho bo hle ba sina nyona ba ikatametse mo di posontse ha o finyana le mo ba dilang gore le bona ba nke ka rolo yena ya ho ba le set top box gore le bona ile ka rolo ya free state ba tla ba une mo lemo mo re go ngona o moholo wa bohlokwa go tsa rona moifo wa hlasela tv ke moja le fara bodinyana le wa mphato wa ka tshepo majabe a reng etse o khotso o fihla la rokopana hape ha e ne pula hopola hlasela tv ke setso ke bomena reinvestment ka kopana lo le moso wa free state